Today I'm in a large one bedroom apartment in downtown Clarendon Hills. Newer building, the building has a fitness center in it. There is parking available. There's also a storage as well as bike storage in the building itself. I'm standing in the living room on the far side over there. You can see the front door. They're nine foot ceilings. So normally these cabinets are 42 inch cabinets would go all the way to the ceiling. You see there's some room at the top. Under cabinet lighting, the nice slide in stove over the stove over the counter microwave. There's garbage disposal. Here's the front door and then the entry closet. Try to get the bathroom without me being in the picture itself, which is sometimes difficult. So the bathroom has a shower, a nice stool here on the end. Looking back across it through the glass, modern lighting, big double vanity, stone countertop on the far side, same cabinets that are in the kitchen. The Toto toilet, room over here if you want to put dirty clothes or something like that. You don't feel too confined. Nice breakfast bar here that will fit a, fit a few stools. Here you have an in-unit washer and dryer. It's not a stackable. I always like that because you always seem to have a, a larger unit as well as the fact that you get the storage on top of it. So you've got room to hang your clothes as they come out of the dryer as well as a spot for laundry. It's a really good size bedroom. It might or might not fit a king size bed. It will definitely fit a queen size bed easily. So if you've got a king size bed, know your measurements when you get here and we'll measure it. I usually have floor plans posted also too. So if you don't see one, just let me know and I can send you one. Here's a really big closet, nice and organized. And you can move these shelves and closet rods to kind of make it your own. See it has six different size or six different rods in it. And one more look. It's an open concept. The high ceilings really make it nice. 